And news still continues on news hour. Just before sports, if you are a public transport user, you're now being told to brace for tougher times ahead after President William Ruto signed the controversial finance bill 2023 into law. Now, the Matato Owners Association says the bill will have a direct impact on the charges by the public service vehicles due to the anticipated hike in fuel prices. Speaking during a meeting with stakeholders in Nakuru, the chairperson of MOA, Albert Karakacha, said that Matatu operators will have no choice but to charge more for their services. Karakacha said that this should not be viewed as a way of punishing you, their client, but as an assurance that they will indeed remain in business. Ile tunungesema kama wanabiashara, ukienda kwa supermarket bei kiongezeka, wa uongeza bei ya bidha. Tungeomba eh, wanachama wetu, waangalie wakiongeza hiyo bei, waangalie na wakue makini sana, wasieze kuumiza abiria. Lakini, kwa kuna ile tunaita demand and supply. Mafuta ikienda juu, ni lazima bei itaenda juu kidogo. Kama mafuta ita, itapanda, hata nasi tutaweza kuongeza fare sababu gari iwezi kuwa kwa barabara kama iwezi kuimentate gari iwezi kuwa kwa barabara kama iwezi kuinulia mikuwa na iwezi kuiweka license so uh, mafuta ikipanda sisi tutaongeza fare ile deficiency ya madriver yetu sio kuendesha kwa steering ile curriculum wagetegeneza ni wategeneza curriculum ambayo itahusisha ya dri defensive driving mambo ya kuhudumia abiria wakati ajali imetokea naona tukemee mambo ya drug abuse mambo ya pobe mambo ya excess na mekaniko sio ndio deficiency ya driver lakini sio ati kwa steering yafanywe retest anafanywe retest na hako na ujuzi ya kutosha